Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today is, what's today? Friday, October 8th, and the time is 2.38. So, let me tell you what's been happening so far. This morning around 8, sorry, let me turn this down. I have Lydia Millen playing on my YouTube channel right now. I'm watching all the way back from April because that's how far I am on keeping up with all my subscriptions that I'm subscribed to on YouTube. Um, but anyway, this morning I wanted to explore the neighborhood a little bit and I saw that there was a park. So I walked for about an hour. Um, I've already closed all my rings on my Apple Watch and it's already 2.40. So it was a nice walk. And I think I'm gonna do that daily and often. And then after my walk to the park, I had ground school for pilot stuff, and that was a few hours. Um, I have a instructor, a private pilot instructor for that. Uh, more about that later, I'll just, I mean, I don't know what to say apart from I'll just take you guys with me when I start flying, and then um, I may take you to a couple lessons that may be in Morristown, New Jersey, so we'll see about that. I need to uh, marinate my dinner. Sorry, I'm like, having a brain fart about everything that I've done today. My studio is already a mess, so I'm going to marinate some short ribs and I'll, you guys can cook with me if you want. You guys know I'm not the best cook ever in the world, but um, when I have a lot of idle time, I will cook, and you, as you guys saw when I was at my parents' house. And I need to do the dishes. Surprisingly, the food that I took with me on my Omaha, Nebraska layover, I ate everything. So I was really surprised by that. I need to clean those dishes. So I'll wash those by hand, stick them in the dishwasher to dry. I just came from the Asian market. I picked up some stuff for tonight's dinner. I picked up my favorite fruit. I don't know if I ever told you guys. No, I told you guys. Persimmons is my favorite fruit. Picked up some of that. I'm exhausted. I got in at 1 a.m. and the sleep wasn't thorough enough but I want to clean my floors I have a lot of stuff I need to order from Amazon I need to order you know what I'm just looking at Lydia I'm thinking how is she vlogging in her kitchen she puts her she puts her camera up in a cabinet somewhere that's what I'm about to do <laughs> sorry ADHD is real all right I'm gonna clean my house clean the floors uh, and while I'm doing all the cleaning I'm gonna um, start the marinade for the short ribs and put the groceries away, put the laundry away, do the floors. I'm rambling on at this point, so I'm gonna keep Lydia on because just to have some white noise going on in the background. Um, not white noise, Jesus Christ, background noise. All right, let's get started. <laughs> Falling deeper, cold and nice, that no more shit. Keep that eggy and no more kid. Just don't let's hide a wish you go. Keep them on hand and go to him. No, I can't just can't. Cause your name, I'm burned. Not your name, got some burned. Tabat your I feel like I'm cleaning like all the time now. <laughs> Clean kitchen. This is the stuff that I'll be using um, tonight for dinner. Is cilantro, pickled radish, and rice from Trader Joe's. Um, I have my persimmons here in a bowl. My camera going from Anthropology, Taylor. Um, Arnold got me this. The flowers are still looking good. The couch. It's tidy, the bed is made, 
the entryway is clear apart from the stuff that's gonna go on the entryway table whenever I decide to get that and the bathroom is clean so I think I'm gonna pour a glass of wine and I need to study and I need to edit I'm just so tired I need to take a nap I need to respond to Laura she's texting me um yeah I haven't got enough sleep so maybe I should just like not look at a computer screen and look at something that doesn't require a lot of brain power and check back in with you guys later and good evening the time is 6.53, I am putting on the Dave Chappelle special. I started it on my layover, um, and I didn't finish it, I fell asleep to it, so. Right now I have the rice going. I have a gnat around here and it is driving me nuts, but I have the rice rinsed. I have three cups of it, and I'm gonna bring it to a boil. I have cilantro cut. I do add salt and butter to my rice when I boil it, and then I'm gonna let it simmer for 30 minutes. I have pickled radish here, and more cilantro to eat with. Oh, the lettuce wraps, I have to pull them out. I'm gonna, I don't know if I should do the mushrooms too. And then I'm gonna wrap it. The beef and the lettuce wraps. here with cilantro, cilantro rice, over here my pickled radish and kimchi, and a glass of Pinot Noir. Hey guys, I just got home from brunch, the time is 1.25. Laura came all the way from Brooklyn to come to my new place and she gave me a housewarming gift, I'll show you. Look how beautiful. She's like, I came to bring some pop of color to your house because I know there ain't no color. So we got some hydrangeas here. They're blue. And look how beautiful this face is. It's gorgeous. So she brought that with her and I gave her a whole tour of my area and my building. And yeah, and then we went to um, downtown Jersey City. We had brunch at this place called Matthew at Matthew. This place called Matthews. Jesus, I can't speak. And um, yeah, we had a good time. She was able to drink. I wasn't because I have to be at, I have to be at work at six o'clock tonight. So um, the house is clean. I cleaned it for her, of course. And then, as you guys know, I cleaned up last night. I had my Korean barbecue, which was really good. And then for brunch, I had the ricotta lemon um, pancakes, which were amazing so right now I need to pack for Dublin I probably won't take anything probably this outfit I need to ask Siri how the weather in Dublin is going to be I'm gonna set you guys down here because I can't I can't be holding you hey Siri what's the weather in Dublin tomorrow it should be nice in Dublin Island tomorrow up to 57 degrees 
All right, so it's gonna be in the 50s, which is fairly chilly. Uh, that's like jacket or coat weather, right? So I'll pack accordingly. I have to study. The layover may not be as exciting as you guys want it to be. I'm not doing any shopping. I don't need any clothes right now. Yeah, I'm gonna bring my lunch, bring some food with me. I have salmon that I'm gonna bring and I was thinking about cooking some broccoli, spinach, maybe the mushrooms in the salad. So I need to bring some veggies with me so those don't go bad. And that is about it. Sorry I didn't bring you guys with me to brunch. I didn't have any memory in my memory card. Look, I stuck you there in the cabinet. <laughs> then I was like, that's a little dark. So I just found another memory card that I can use to vlog with and then I wanted, I really wanted to edit. So it's 1.30, I have to be at work at six. So like, can I leave here at 4.45 and not run into any traffic? Do I have enough time? I think that I do, so. Um, yeah, I really want to start editing today Saturday because I want to put up a video Sunday. So let's do a little bit of editing for like an hour. Then we'll do some food to take with us for our trip. Let's look at the spinach. Mm. All right, the spinach. Sorry, so much light in my apartment now. Spinach is so good. We'll cook a lot of this and have some with salmon. And then, ooh, cilantro. The mushrooms, how are you guys holding up? The mushrooms are good. Um, They're clean and then I have them sitting in a tubware like this, so they're still good. Mm -hmm. Still good to go. All this freaking salmon. I'm not gonna take all of it, I'm just gonna take some of the salmon. And some of this salad that's in here. I'm gonna set you guys down in my refrigerator. Hmm. All right, the salad is still really good. So maybe this and the salmon for dinner later on and then salmon and broccoli for the layover and then I'm gonna need one more meal for the flight home. I'm gonna worry about that now. I'm gonna worry about that in a couple hours. Let's have a Diet Coke. And let's edit. I can't wait till I get a bar stool so I can sit down at the counter. Right, this is everything that's going in my lunchbox to Dublin. These are my Encrustable sandwiches. I have two. I have my protein drink. This is salmon and foil, so I can use that, put that in the oven. This is broccoli and mushrooms in here. And then this is just a salad and spinach mixture together. Uh, this is salmon and spinach. And I like these glass containers because again, I can also put them in the oven on the plane. And then this is just broccoli. This is raw broccoli. I will put some water in this and um, some salt and some pepper, pe pepper, 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 some salt and some pepper and put this also on the plane or I may um, even eat this at the hotel. So yeah, this will last me for today, Sunday and Monday. So I did about an hour and a half two hours of editing and I put out a TikTok video and then I started editing my flight attendant to real estate agent to pilot video. You guys will have already seen that by the time you watch this. And the time is 4.17 I have to be at work at 6. Something 6.19 I believe and yeah, I'm just, um, I have like the makeup that I travel with over here in this corner in my kitchen. These are beauty blenders that are being disinfected right now. I know that looks really nasty. And then I'm gonna wipe down all my makeup with alcohol wipes. And this is like my little charging station. This is my real estate phone. This is my 
um, United phone that's being left on the charger and just like my little pouch that I use to keep all like my cables and stuff in. I also, since I'm going to Dublin, I need to remember to bring this. Since we are banning the dress, we are team no dress for a while, I'm wearing the pants and the zip down top. Um, this is what, if you ever see me, this is usually what I'm wearing. I have on my um, Burberry cashmere sweater and then I'll, of course it's international flight. I have my blazer, which even domestically when I, like, when I fly, I always keep my blazer on because I think it's um, a pantsuit is a look. Uh, my mirror on the floor here, just show, I'm just showing you my pants that I have and my socks. So, I'll probably um, see you guys at the airport. <laughs> Let's go to work. Alright guys, look at these. Okay, I just realized that I haven't been on this plane in about two and a half years, right? Has it been that long? At least two years? At least a year? Oh my gosh, this is like a foreign concept to me, but I'm working first class galley. It's me and the purser, and I'm going to take all the orders. Uh, right now, we are waiting on catering, and I have not been catered yet, so I can't do any of my like galley prep stuff. So, anyway. One of the girls, Shiloh, me and Shiloh, we went to Paris together a long, long time ago. She, she was actually on like one of my very first Paris trips. She booked a tour to the Trinity um, University Library, and I told her that I wouldn't be able to go because I'm in school and I'm studying, so I'm really sad about that. And um, yeah, it's just like a lot of the sacrifices that I have to make, right, in order to get my private pilot's license, but Hopefully the Trinity University Library will always be there. Um, I don't take anything for granted. So yeah, we're on a 767. And it's great to be back on this airplane. <laughs> so if my guess is right, we are gonna be delayed because I see cargo out here. Lots of cargo, which is blocking the way that catering would come. Like catering, there's no way that catering can get their truck through here. They would have to go under the wing and I know that I know they're not gonna do that so I do know that we are gonna be delayed nobody's loading cargo nobody's loading anything at this point so we're probably gonna be delayed like nine times out of ten all right departure is 725 it's now 623 so I'll let you guys know if we leave out of here on time <laughs> or something like that and I had just actually gotten up from a nap walked around my bedroom a little bit and um, I'm getting ready just to do a little bit of exercise before I start studying and uh, before I start editing some content and yeah it just sucks at least I'm saving money I mean I really would love to go out and do the Trinity University um, library tour with the girls, with Shyla. Shyla and I, we've had some crazy times together on our layovers in the past, so it's really good to see her. I just wish that we could all hang out and have a good time. Let me give you a little um, hotel room tour really fast. Let me get my makeup wipe um, off the counter so you can see just how big this bathroom is. This is the bathtub here, shower. Oh, my toiletries up there on this ledge right here. Toilet, and you have a shower. So this bathroom is huge. It's 
almost like a handicapped bathroom, but it's not. You can just tell because the um, door frame's not that wide. I have a desk here with a TV. This bed, huge king size bed. I had the best nap. I have a full size mirror here and a lamp. And yeah, this is just the rest of the room. I have my stuff here, my lunchbox. I have my food in the refrigerator right here and just my clothes sprawled out. Uh, over here on this luggage rack wardrobe section area so yeah i'm not sure i don't think i'm gonna take you guys with me on my walk it's not gonna be long i'm gonna do like an hour walk and um maybe come back to the gym i don't know i don't want to spend too much time like working out the layover is not it's only 24 hours so i need to drink some water get my life together i'll check back in with you guys later though i may stop by we have a happy hour at 5 or 5 30 in the lobby and just have, like have some wine maybe we'll just see how i feel i'm so tired so jet lagged I feel like i've been slapped around but um i am gonna take my phone with me on my walk because it is nice outside i mean the days like this is rare okay and so i'm gonna take advantage of it and run around out there I'm not gonna go downtown, I'm just gonna walk around like this suburb little neighborhood area. So I'll check back in with you guys. <laughs> My little one hour workout turned into a two hour workout because I did like an hour walk. And then um, when I got back to the hotel, I was like, let me just stop here in the gym and just do some weights. So I did <laughs> biceps, triceps, I did back, and then I did um, hamstrings. And yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. They don't have a microwave, but they said that if I brought my food down, that they could microwave it for me and bring it up to my room. I'm not hungry right now, as you guys see. I am having a um, protein shake with Premier Protein. And I must say that the ice in this hotel, hands down, the best ice. I love like the little chunks of ice. It's a vibe. So now I am, I'm really about to um, study I'm gonna study and read probably for 90 minutes. Take a break, probably watch something on Netflix and then I'm going to edit for 90 minutes and then I'm gonna text my instructor, my flight instructor now to let him know that I probably won't be able to do ground school tomorrow. He wanted to do it tomorrow after I land from Dublin. But I honestly, from today and then, honestly, if I'm just studying for today and then reading today, this chapter that I have to read. I'm not going to retain anything if he asks me a question on it tomorrow afternoon. Like, there's just no way. 
There's absolutely no freaking way. So I'm gonna have him move it to my day off, which I'm off Tuesday, but I have to work Wednesday. So I'm gonna text him now to let him know that, listen, we're gonna have to move ground school to Tuesday, okay? Right now it's 3.47. I know everybody's probably gonna do happy hour. I may stop by there. Instead of like watching something on Netflix, I may stop by there for a glass of wine. And then maybe that's when I'll like warm up my food. But yeah, I just wanna make sure that I get good and good amount of sleep tonight and hopefully i can sleep tonight and don't sleep like don't fall asleep an hour before pickup which would just suck absolutely suck oh and if you were wondering we were delayed we were delayed leaving newark going to dublin so no surprise there <laughs> all right let me text my instructor and then i'll check back in with you guys later Terrible, terrible vlogger. So last night, I know that you guys probably thought that I may have, um, sorry, I'm back right here. Here we are. That I was going to go to happy hour. I did not end up studying all night long. I'm going to end up FaceTiming my flight instructor so we could go over some stuff. So that's all that I did. Like, you guys didn't miss a thing. So I didn't do that. Good morning. I ended up studying all night long. I didn't go to happy hour. And then this morning, my friend Dan, he FaceTimed me. And so we FaceTimed, and it was like 1 30 in the morning in Atlanta. So, and then, um, so I didn't get to talk to you when I woke up this morning, and then I went straight down to breakfast, and I got the same thing the uh, porridge and the white pudding. So, yeah, guys, I will probably just continue to vlog um, the rest of the week since there really wasn't a lot of footage for this Dublin layover. Just do like this as a weekly vlog. So, Let's just go ahead and keep that going. Like again, like I told you guys, I'm working for a spot scally. And um, I'm gonna get up there now and start doing all the prep and stuff. And I'll probably see you guys when we get back to Jersey. <laughs> 